hi guys welcome back to my channel it's Francesca here today I'm going to be showing you how to make a beef brisket stew so of course with a beef brisket stew we are gonna need our beef briskets <laughs> so it's just over here we've got two kg worth of beef briskets that you're gonna need then we've got as well our ingredients so we have our carrots with the carrots, we're gonna use six carrots that I've peeled. And if you're gonna cut them, if you've got a large carrot, just cut it in half. We don't need to cut it any more thinner. And that is because we're gonna be cooking it for a long time and you do not want it to turn into mash. So do not cut it any thinner than this if you are. Anyway, then we have our garlic cloves. So we've got six garlic cloves. Again, you don't need to necessarily cut it if you, if you don't want to. You can if you do. Um, what I've done is I've cut it, but I've literally just cut them into half the cloves. So we're gonna use six garlic cloves as well. Then we've got our honey, honey, honey. And um, we're gonna use four tablespoons of honey. Our prunes as well, just a handful of prunes. And our lemon juice. With the lemon juice, you literally just get a lemon and then you cut it in half, squeeze it, take the pips out and boom. There's your lemon juice. <laughs> so we're gonna use four tablespoons of lemon juice. Then we have our chicken stock. So we've got 700 milliliters of chicken stock here that we're gonna use for the stew. Then we have our Merlot red wine, not to get drunk, <laughs> to use it in the dish. We're gonna use two tablespoons of red wine. Our bisto, so I've got onion gravy, we're gonna use one tablespoon of the gravy. Our onions, I've used four onions that I've cut up, like normal there. And then we've got our empty container here that we're gonna fill up with water and I'm gonna show you guys how to make homemade gravy as well. So I'm excited to show you how to make the dish. Let's begin and I hope you guys enjoy.
guys, the meat is finally finished. It's now been three hours and I am starving. The food here looks to die for. It looks amazing. Literally, the meat is just falling off. I don't know if you can see, but it's just falling off. It's amazing. Anyway, guys, <laughs> I'm gonna dig in. I don't know about you, but this, mm, 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 looks yummy. Mmm. God, it's so, so tender. It's so tender, so sweet. Mmm. It's delicious. It's so yummy. Guys, try this dish out. Let me know how my recipe gets on. And I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Please like, please subscribe, share, and let me know what you want me to cook next. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.